centering and alignment in Illustrator and Photoshop. When creating a logo or design in Adobe Illustrator, objects can be aligned in relation to the artboard as a whole, to other shapes in the workspace, or even guidelines. Let's say you create a square, and you want this square dead center in your workspace. First, go to Window and make sure the Align tools are showing, or click Shift F7. Next, click the Align To button and select Align to Artboard. Now select the square. Click the Horizontal Align Center icon and the Vertical Align Center icon. Now you're dead center. With these tools you can move your shape horizontally to the far left, center, or far right, or vertically to the top, center, or bottom. If you want to align or center a shape or group in relation to another, hold Shift and click both objects. Then, with the object selected, release the Shift key and click on the base object one more time. Now, click your Align buttons. You can place the first shape anywhere you want in relation to the second. The same process relates to guidelines. Hit Shift, select the shape and the guideline, release Shift, and select the guide. Now use your Align tools. If you zoom in, you'll notice the text is not quite touching the edge of the guide. Simply right-click on the text and select Create Outlines. Now repeat the process, and voila! In Photoshop, the process is a bit different. To align to your workspace, click on the layer you wish to move and hit Command-A to select All. You'll notice a marquee box forms. Make sure the Move tool is selected, and then click on your Align tools. When you're done, hit Command-D to deselect and clear the marquee box. Now, let's say you want to align text to a specific section of your image. Simply select the marquee tool and draw a box around the area you want to work with. Make sure your text layer is clicked and use your Align tools. And there you have it. You are now a pro at centering and alignment in Illustrator and Photoshop.